Hello, Internet. Welcome to Star Trucker. My truck looks like it's seen some better days, but uh, I decided to start here. I was going to start docked up. Look at that truck. Real beauty. Uh, I was going to dock up to one of these, probably the job board, but I saw so there are these two stores and they have two different names, so I'm going to check them both out. I'm curious what the difference is. Like, do they stock all the same stuff? What, you know, a cash and carry is sort of like a 7-Eleven or a, you know, the stab and grab. So I'm curious what, uh, I'm just curious. I'm exploring the world around me. I'm aligning to the wrong docking clips. So... We'll stop in here, whatever this was called. It also makes me wonder, too. So if they do carry similar things, is there, you know, is there the possibility that one store may be, like, someone may be docked at it when I'm trying to come up, and therefore, you know, I'd need to go to the other one? I don't know. There, there are two stores in one spot, so I want to know what that means. Okay. So their price of batteries is pretty high. I can buy some soda. What I'm going to do... So I'll sell those because they're both dead. Uh, What do these things sell well? No, oh, those are up a bit. I'll sell this data cable, because I don't think I need it for repairing stuff, like I thought. Uh, I need more batteries and more of these things, but their prices aren't great. Uh, their price for an air filter is quite good, comparatively. Uh, they're still expensive as I'll get out. I'm gonna buy some sodas, because I'm also curious what those do. I'm guessing... Can I drink these? Okay, no, I can just sell them. Well, yeah, it's nice to have some drinks for long drives. So... Okay, that's one shop. Also... I love that they're just sitting there. With gravity, they'll stay until, you know, gravity fails, but that's just neat. Uh, oh, I am... Hold on a second. I'm losing oxygen. Do I have a whole leak? Potentially. Uh, let's go take a gander. I think I looked at that screen. Uh... I'm not getting the pop-up. I don't think I have a leak. I think I'm literally just... The whole integrity has collapsed so much from my various uh, collisions. I'm just leaking like a sieve. Uh, oh, right. So that does bring up a good question. Is there somewhere... There was a gas station. I don't know if there's anywhere for repairs. Uh... If I'm losing oxygen... I wonder if it's just that my filters are getting low? That's part of my issue? And everything seems working. Uh... Okay, we're just gonna... Well, no. I'm, I'm only one tick of oxygen down. I think I'll survive. Let's see what's at the store. 
Then we'll get a job real quick and we will make our way on to this other guy's place. Okay, so these guys have a lot of stuff. But yeah, it is this. That's interesting. So they have a lot of stuff, but it's the same prices. And I think that's about what I bought the sodas for. I don't know. Uh, yeah, so that's all market value. I should probably buy a few of those and one of those. Uh, and we'll just sell, we'll sell all of that. Because I don't think we need it. Oh, no. These things aren't selling very well, but they are selling. Uh, I can buy out all their batteries. All right. Put those away. Hopefully survive the loss of oxygen until we can get somewhere with a repair stop. That's something that's a little... I don't know. It, I feel like it makes more sense for everywhere to have... You know, I do still have one of those. It makes more sense for everywhere to have a repair shop. In my mind. But... I guess it adds a little bit more... Gameplay drama if that's not the case. Seems odd to only have one garage in the galaxy. So, where did I need to go? Not Purity, not Atlas Prime. Dang. I don't think any of these are going where I need to go. Alright. Well, we tried. Let's just go head over there. With luck. Yeah, Emerald Junction. With luck, this place will be a... A repair yard in addition to upgrades and other stuff. Also, ah, so these are express gates. Wonder what the difference is. I wonder if these may be like toll roads. Oh, yeah. Hit the wrong button. My alignment is poor. On we go. Yep, $50 for a toll. Yeah. This is lovely, though. So, what's the deal, then? Ah, I see. So, you can get to some of these places... So like Atlas Prime to Three Kings, there's a direct route where you have to pay a toll. Otherwise, you would have to make like one, two, three, four, five jumps. Yeah, same for here. You could get from Medusa Six Emerald Junction, but we have to go all around the place. I don't know what's going on there, but... Anyway, is that a space diner? Looks like a space diner. Uh, okay, let's go over here. This Goodman Tower. Hopefully, I've noticed as you get closer, it says like, you know, there's the big dot that is, here's a station. As you get closer, it spreads out into more things. Oh yeah, this has... Supplies. Hey, how's it going? You got time to chat? Uh, hold on, I've got a break. 
Sure, what's going I've been on? thinking about all the long haul contracts I've taken recently. Those are my favorite kinds of gigs, you know? But they rack up the miles pretty damn fast. Yeah. Between the distance and micro damage, I end up needing new coats of paint even faster than sour candy does. Of course, Fair she enough. doesn't care that much about the style. Ah, uh, well, I'm, I'm all about style. How many miles do you have on that rig of yours? Uh. I mean, it's not more than 80,000, but it's close. Don't also, don't lie to impress me, you know? Yeah, uh, well, I shouldn't have lied. I don't know where you're really at with your miles, but here's the deal. Uh, the deal well, is I'm very low on air. Bears, right? But the dealerships won't allow any customizations to your rig. Ah. Like shiny new paint jobs. But when the warranty's up, you get to do whatever you want with it. You catch my drift? Ah. Uh, Great. yes, my Once air rattled brain. I see. Okay, so I can't upgrade. I'm almost there. I gotta run. So I'll leave you to it. Catch you again soon, LJ. Uh, well, maybe. Things are getting fuzzy. I was hoping there would. There's a bunch of fuel. There's not much fixing. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. Let's just. You know, put us on trajectory to crash into this building. I think I'm about to go to sleep. Uh-oh. I'm wondering if there was repair here. Can I get close enough to find out? Oh. Uh-oh. It's nap time. Oh boy. Huh. Well, here I am back here again. Uh, luckily the repairs are free. And actually this puts me... Yep, repairs and recovery. Lost some money. Got 53 miles before I can upgrade. Uh, I can, however. Just scooch you over here. Get the old truck fixed. So, okay. That makes sense. So, I can. So, I can, I guess, upgrade this stuff, but I can't do any fun cosmetics until. later all right uh, yeah oxygen is still depleting I wonder why let's do some quick uh that has something to do with it. Uh, let's do some poking around. So I think oxygen... Yeah. That's going bad, but it's still working for now. We're using more air than we are outputting? Don't know what that's for. That's gravity. Those are both good. Those are both still good. Gravity is almost out of power. Why is the air being bad? Yeah, so my issue here, my output is 10 liters per hour, my usage is 23. So I'm using more air than I am making. Let's go. Oh, hold on. Ah. Air filter's getting low.
Oh. So I can have up to four of those things. Okay. Uh, well, I think I have an air filter. So that's interesting. The air filters lose efficiency as they go. So even though the thing is still fine, it doesn't, uh, it doesn't let me use it. That's kind of a pain that they, you know, there's still percentage points on that air filter I could be enjoying. But yeah, okay. Also, I guess that's why it benefits you to have multiple, so that they can wear out some of them. Well, it'll last me for a while. Let's go get a job. Uh, let's do the classic sort by payout. Hmm, some good old synthetic gelatin. Back to Edinburgh. Uh, you know what? I want to try... Yes, yeah, so that's coming in. I'm going to try all three of these. Because they're all from here going to the same place. I want to try my hand at hauling a bunch of stuff. I'm also curious... Actually... Mm, I may have just made a mistake. I don't know if I can actually hook multiple containers together. Hmm, because I only have the one lever. Well, we'll find out real quick, won't we? Uh, looks like all my cargo's over here. On the other side of the blue planet. Yeah, I wonder... I wonder if there's an option to, like, go outside and manually connect them. Also, backing these things... Backing three trailers into each other is going to be a pain in the butt. I may have to, uh... Say no to one of these... Potential gigs. Alright... Coast our way through the garbage patch. Ow! Okay. I failed at coasting through the garbage patch. Whoops. Maybe going at high speed through a debris cloud isn't the best decision. Uh, dang, it's always this fender I bump into things, too. Ah. Come on, keep welding with your mind. Alright. Hey, at least I didn't have cargo on me. Alright. Oh! There goes the gravity. Yeah, well, I, I can fix this. It definitely is getting the vibe of I'm having to, you know, I'm keeping the thing running with duct tape and dreams, which is a fun, I mean, you know, when you're some of the space trucker, sort of a Han Solo figure, it may, you know, you kind of want that, that feeling of constantly having to keep the thing barely scraping by. I will say this game is so far doing a pretty good job of encouraging uh, encouraging that just 
in the fact that it's kind of annoying to have to go and buy replacement parts all the time, so you just ignore it because you don't want to. Alright. First one, let's see... What we can do about this other one. Uh, oh! I don't know if I can still see it. Good. I worried for a second that my other cargo had gone away. Also... I signed up for three jobs. I'm only seeing two... Oh. Dang it. My other one was back where I was. I missed it earlier. Okay. Well, we're over here now. Let's see if we can connect to two things at once. Uh, what I may try and do here too, because this is a uh, this is sort of a fly-through bay, I'm just going to go next to this cargo container so that hopefully I don't have to do very much turning around as I reverse. And the game is smart enough to be like, oh, you're docking to a second trailer, we'll control the correct mag lock for you. Oh. Okay, I hit, hit something ever so slightly. This is the tricky part. It's the sort of reversing in dance I gotta do. I think I just hit it. Uh, hmm. I am going to take a quick little jaunt outdoors. Just to see if there's anything I can do out here to hook these two... Oh boy. Hook these two things together. Yeah, I'm a little far off. Maybe what happens is once I... Like, if I unlock when they're both in position, it'll go through and connect to both. Let's try that. Uh, okay, let's try. So we unhitch. Hitch to both. No. Uh, also, the suit charger's a little low, but that's fine. Uh, okay, as much as I don't like it, I think for these maneuvers I'm going to have to use C. I mean, I got it lined up right, it's just a matter of being there. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to be able to haul both of these. So I didn't see any like switches out there. I should be lined up enough. I wonder... Is it a skill? So there's long distance, there's fragile... Ah! chance for jobs with multiple trailers. Yeah. Ooh, oversized load sounds fun. Uh, perishables, yada yada. Well, that's a bit of a pain. So I can take two, I can take multiple jobs, but I can't haul multiple loads. Huh. Well, that's fine. Let's make our way on to 
Medusa 6. We'll drop this one off and I guess we could always come back for the others, but I'm probably, I'll be honest, I'm probably just gonna forego worrying about it. Though maybe it doesn't give me the mileage I need. supposed to be. I just keep creeping up on this guy. I wonder what would happen if I tried to go through with him. Probably nothing good. Imagine we'd get spliced into one weird mutant truck. Miles don't really rack up that far. Probably need to do a few more jobs to unlock customization. I may just do that on my own and tack on, you know, whatever that looks like at the end of the video. Uh, also, ah, I see where the drop zone here is. Is this another? Ah, yeah, it's probably a one to reverse into. Got a problem in the climate regulation. And so this is something you can't do in a normal truck, is once it reaches its full travel, I can just yaw the whole trailer around. And if I go back the other way, I can just line it up. And let the weird angular momentum mechanics carrier through. And there. Uh, oh, I did wreck a little bit. That's why I got that thing. Uh, all right, what's going on? Those are almost out. We got faults there. It's getting a little warm. Yeah, let's do some fixing. Ah. Um. Oh. Uh oh. This is interesting. Ow. Okay, I'm out. Apparently. You walk up here and just the wrong way, you can get stuck. Oh. Did it on that side. It's apparently very easy to get stuck in here. Uh, there's the climate junk. Alright, there's that. What else we've got? That'll be fine. Who I just almost hit. Can I? I don't know if I can do business with them. Oh, okay. I was curious to see if I could thread that gap. Uh, the answer was no. Oh, and this isn't great because the suit battery is almost out. I don't know exactly what that means. I assume it means that the suit won't get refilled if I have an issue. Ah. Got 
blasted with gas. There we go. Uh, where was I going? This way, I think. I'm curious what... What's it called? What this foundry hall is. If it's another place to get jobs other than that silver yard. So... Now that I'm here... Not seeing any other docking options. Dang. Yeah. So there's, I suppose, one thing this game could do with maybe a bit... Well, I don't know. Because obviously you don't really need more destination variety. You know, you don't need more places to go. It's interesting, though, that that... I wonder if that uh, first area, Alpha Prime or whatever it was called, I bet you that's where the demo took place. So they had a bunch more stuff so that you could, you know, basically fly around the demo area. With these other places, there are other cool destinations with their own unique challenges, but they aren't as busy or crowded because they don't need to be. Because now they're one destination of many. Oh boy. Our whole integrity is null. Uh, suit's also broken, but... That's something we'll deal with. I don't know, maybe I should worry about the suit not... ...working right, because I'm, that may be the only thing that keeps me alive here in a moment. Uh... Let's see, I know I'm not aligned. Uh, I think I need to be better. Ooh. Oh! Uh, 
Hmm. Okay, I may have foregone some important things. Uh, let's get a little toasty. Let's see if we can't fix the old... Where's this climate regulator? There we go. That's back. That's out of battery, but I'm not as worried. Uh, that one's dead too. Probably also losing oxygen at the moment, but can that fix it? Maybe, maybe not. Uh, let's turn the, uh, yeah, turn the AC up. There we go. That's getting it nice. I've really screwed the pooch on this docking. It's partially because I'm not really even trying. I've reached the point where I'm like, okay, I could take a break. But I really want to get the footage I need. And I, oh boy, I think I just hit it again. Yeah. I mean, at this point, I could just kind of bat this cargo container all the way to where it needs to go. But you know, I think maybe this is where I call it. There is customization, uh, it's in there, it exists. I don't feel like getting to it anymore, so I won't. Uh, maybe I'll do another episode of this if these episodes do well and people are clamoring for more Star Trekker. I'll definitely be playing this more in just my own personal time, but I think for now it is a good time to give it a rest. So thank you everybody so much for watching. Feel free to check out any of the other stuff I've done. There's uh, more space engineers and whatnot coming. But yeah, until next week, bye-bye.